So with school starting up again, many of us are rushing around to get that shopping done. But what are some of the must have items for this school year? Metro Mom Barb is here to take a look at what's fun and also fabulous. And I see a lot of things. So just walk us through it. What'd you bring, Barb? Okay, the most uh, new thing to the market is these backpacks from O3. And what companies have done, O3 has really gone back to the drawing board and designed something that is very comfortable. It's very ergonomic and it has breathable pockets. But they have combined the lunch cooler oh. with the backpack so you don't have to carry as many tote right. bags around. So you can store your lunch in there. And this is also something that's very different and new. These are from Aladdin. The ice packs are in each individual container. Mm -hmm. So instead of having an ice pack keeping something mushy and something cold at the same right. time, you can just individualize your containers in okay. that way. Kids love to express themselves. They want to look cool. You don't want to break the bank. These t-shirts <laughs> are from Threadless. Dot com, and they literally have hundreds, if not thousands, of different kinds of very cool designs for $10, $15. Um, so this is kind of a new take on the My Dog Ate the Homework shirt. Oh, neat. And this is taking some pop culture, something that's Phineas and Ferb, very popular with the kids, and adding that school uh, learning twist to it as well. Now, you can also personalize your clothing. Mm -hmm. uh, we made these at Crazy Dog uh, T shirts. You made this? So, this yeah, you can, <laughs> if your kids made some great art over the summer, put it on a T shirt. This is something none of their friends are going to have. Mm -hmm. And it's a great way to keep artwork. And, right. and this is something also, there's no minimum. So, you can just do one shirt with each design. That's really great. You're talking about personalization. Personalization is very big. And so, some companies have um, brought out things like this notebooks and pencil boxes that you can color in. A great way to save some money is to buy things that are very plain, just mm -hmm. solid colors, and then just buy some embellishments that you can peel and stick yourself and, and add a little personal touch that way. Now, you're also talking about parents maybe stay away from some things that could be used in the classroom. Well, you don't want to show up for your first day of school and have a t-shirt that says, to too cool for school, for example. The teachers really, yeah, you don't want the teachers to peg your child as that child that doesn't right. want to study. And also, if it's very distracting, the teachers probably prefer for it not to be brought into the classroom. Okay, Metro Mom Barb, thank you so much for coming in and giving us these tips. Of course, for more ideas, go to our website, cbsdfw.com, and click on links and numbers.